Hello everyone, I am Susie. I am Lucy. Today we will take you to the Kit Castle. There are many good stories and lots of fun toys in the Kit Castle. Let's go together. Hooray! Hi my friends, today I am going to read those books for you. And now let's get started. Mm -hmm. Got it. One dia, count and celebrate. One dia, count and celebrate. How many maths does the Kwanzaa celebrate use? One, one symbol of Kwanzaa is the mat or MK card that is placed on the table during the celebration. All the other Kwanzaa symbols are put on the mat. The mat reminds the reminds people of their history and all the people who came before them. The mat is often woven from cloth, straw, or even paper. Paper. How many ears of corn are they are on the mat? Two corn or muhenji is is a symbol of Kwanzaa. Families will put one ear of the corn on the mat for each child they hold. If a family does not have children, two ears of corn are put on the mat. Children are the hopeful of the future. The utility cap um, or in Kikan Bay Chao Maja is also on the mat. Mat, the unity cup reminds people of family and to share one with one, uh, to share with one another. How many colors of Kwanzaa are there? Three. The three colors of Kwanzaa. The colors are black, red, and green. Uh, black stands for the people who came from Africa. Red helps people remain, remember the hard times. Green gives the people hope that things will get better. These colors are often found on flags. People will wear clothing in black, red, and green. They may also decorate their home with flags, with flags, crafts, or other things with these colors. Showing these three colors how screen people during the war during Kwanzaa. Do you know why? Why is uh, do you know why the candles is as the middle is a black and the rest are red and green? Why? Because this flag. Mm -hmm. You see, okay. I will, I will, I will explain it because you see this metal. Okay, we uh, it's looking like this. Uh, like like colony is like uh, like row uh, like this a rectangle like this colony so now here you see here is the here the black is on the middle right mm -hmm. so it's like this and now you see you see you see the black is on the middle right and you see the red is on here you see red is on here so now and green on the rest you see yeah i saw it yeah you don't like look this. look diagonally mm -hmm. you will see it you will see it how many crabs do you see for another symbol of pointy are crabs or Mezazo, mezazo. Crops take a lot of work and care to grow. People will place a bowl full of fruits or vegetables on the mat. These four crops remind people when they, when that when they work together at something that is hard to do, they will win, win in the end. Mm -hmm. How many gifts do you see? Five. This boy has has five gifts to open. Giving gifts or zawadi is important during Kwanzaa. It's a symbol a symbol that reminds people how important we are to one another. We need other people. Um, parents give, give children gifts to thank for them. So 
to thank them for the work they will do in the future. Future children are reminded that parents work hard to make the world a better place. How many women dance? Six. These six women dance during Kwanzaa celebration. Kwanzaa gatherings are held in many different places. Some are in churches or community centers. Others are in homes. Stories are read and songs are sung in some places. There might be a parade or dances to celebrate the holiday. You see, they're all in temples, right? So wait, this does it look like a temple, you see? Yeah, it's a temple. Looks like a temple, right? Mm -hmm. You see, they are wearing, all wearing these. Most people, you see. Some yeah. are even wearing hats. Yeah. Let's break the holiday. How many candles are there? Seven. There are seven candles or... Oh, or Mishma uh, Saba. The first three are red, the middle one is black, and the last three are green. The first three are red, the middle one is black, and the last three are green. The first candle lit is the black candle. The candle helps people to remember the work and to work together. Next, the red candles are lit. The green candles are last. Every night, a new candle is lit. By the last night, all sandal can seven candles are lit. The candles are placed in a special candle can candle holder called uh, Kinara. Kinara. The Kinara is placed on the Kwanzaa match and is an important part of the celebration. Mm -hmm. How many harvest food do you see? Kwanzaa. Kwanzaa means First fruits in African language called uh, Sahili. Sahili. People will put on uh, put out different fruits, vegetables, and nuts on the Kwanzaa mat. Some of these uh, fruits are apples, bananas, corns, squash, nuts, and tomatoes. Many people find whatever fruits are fresh for their Kwanzaa celebration when these eat fruits. You see, they are using the statues. You see, Kwanzaa statues, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. How many African symbols do you see? Nine. 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 During Kwanzaa, it's important for Afri Amer African Americans to remember their African past. People will decorate their homes with African symbols. The symbols are African baskets, masks, small, small statues, or blankets with African designs. These nine African symbols help teach people about their past and, and help them celebrate their um, culture. Culture. Mm -hmm. culture, you see, they decorate, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Did they decorate their, their things? Yeah. How many people will court celebrate Kwanzaa? Kwanzaa. 10. Kwanzaa is a holiday that celebrates with family and friends. People share food, music, stories, and time together. It's important that people share the holiday as a group because many of the seven principles of Kwanzaa need people to work with one another. These 10 people are sharing a Kwanzaa celebration. More information on Kwanzaa. Kwanzaa last seven days. 
It starts on December the 26th and ends on January the 1st. Each a day of Kwanzaa celebrates a, diff, a different principles or idea. The principle is talked about the people who think of ways to love it. Dr. Malana Karana starts Kwan, started Kwanzaa in 1966. He did it as a way to help Afri African Americans to celebrate their background. Doctor uh, Doctor Ken Kenaga found African American people need to take each year to think about who were as a group. He looked at the African harvest festivals. Harvest festivals are celebrated when people gather food from the fields. The word from Kwanzaa means first food, fruits in Sahawi. Sahawi is a language people speak mostly in East Africa. Dr. Karaga wanted Kwasia to be a time for making plans for coming the year. For the coming year. When people make promises that help help themselves, their families, and their community, millions of African Americans celebrate Kwanzaa every year. People from many different backgrounds all around the world also celebrate Kwanzaa. Most of these people live in Africa, Canada, the Caribbean, and Europe. Mm -hmm. Okay, so many people celebrate the Kwanzaa. Oh, I think Alexander celebrates too. Who is Alexander? Alexander Hamilton. Oh, really? <laughs> because he he is born on the Caribbean island. Oh, really? Caribbean island. Oh, yes. I see. Caribbean. Remember so many things. He he was uh, born on the Car Caribbean island, isn't it? Yeah. I think my dad's home nearly celebrate that too. Why? Because my dad uh, was uh, was the last two years were living on Canada. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe. You can ask him. Yes. Because you see, yes, I'll get my earth globe. Because you see, here, the dad is here, British Columbia. And then you see, here, this big is all Canada. See, this Canada, mm -hmm. British Columbia, just, um, just nearly this. In the Canada. Yes, in the Canada, so these will celebrate too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe. Okay, are we done here for this one? No, I'll show you to find the Caribbean. I'll show you here. No. I can first show them. That would be high. Caribbean, Cuba. Oh, I think it's around here, is it? Or no? Not here. Yeah. Caribbean Sea, yeah, that's still a bit high, we're Caribbean Sea. Mm -hmm. Then, you see, Caribbean, yeah, Caribbean is born here. Yeah. Caribbean, so, and this is where Hamilton born. Oh, really? Uh, his, his home is only, only a little cabin. Okay. And then, and then you see uh, his his outer place, and he then the rest of his home was all sea. Oh really? Yes. That, that's interesting. All of sea are all yeah, sea. Yeah, that's pretty, right? He had to sail mm -hmm. if he want to move out his move out his home. Mm -hmm. <laughs> interesting. Count again. Okay, I'll ask you to count. What did we say off? This is for the remembrance. Mm, how many? Count? Can you come? I couldn't no. find them. If you couldn't find them, then you can say out now. I couldn't find them. One is what? 
What? Say. I don't know. Can you see? Can you check, check that page. Can you check it for a fair? Like Do you know what it is? Mm -hmm. This says. Uh, this is the M card, K card, M K card. Let's see what's two. How about what's two? What's two? Would you show your friend? No. Why? We can look, but you can look. I don't know. I ask you need to you show your friends. I will. Ask, I will ask you new questions. I don't know. Muhan, Muhanji. Okay. How about the three? What is it? Do you know if you don't look at it? Yes, the Kwanzaa flag. Okay, and four? Three stripes. The four is the vegetable. Mm, the four is our class and that's our Mazao. Mazao. And the five is a gift. That's play from here. Mm -hmm. And six are the dancing moments. Okay. Seven. Seven are the are the candles. Mm -hmm. Eight are the are the crabs. And are the first food. Uh, and language are First, Kwanzaa means first food law of the language called Swahili. And nine is the decorated symbols, ten is ten people. Okay, here. Yeah. Want to say goodbye? Yes, bye. See you next time. So that's all for today. If you have nice toys or fun toys, remember to write to Susie and Lucy. We will share it with every kid in the first place. If you like our channel, remember to click on the subscription below. Susie and Lucy are waiting for you here. See you soon.